Hi all, I wanted to talk with you about Knife Crime in 2015, Part 8. Basically, it's, it's continued from from the one I done. Uh, it's continued from the one on Part 7, where it says on Part 8, Mother weeps in court as as son 16 is accused of stabbing teen to death in central London London Street so it says that was the title this is the other part of the title subtitle so it says it says a mother wept wept in court as her 16 year old son was remand, rem, rem, remanded in custody over the murder of a young man stabbed to death in the street The, juven the juvenile who cannot be named for legal reasons is accused of is accu 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 sorry accused of fatally wo fatally wo wounding Bilal Mez 18 as he walked through Mar 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 Marlebon Central London at Marylebone, Central London, at around 10:40 p.m. on Thursday. So, like I said in one of my videos about, I, t I titled it. I titled it. What will happen if I carry guns? guns sorry what will happen what will happen if i cr carry knives and guns around around me so basically basically i was talking about how you know you won't you know you won't get away with a crime and 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 to, and to add to all of these all of this as well add to, to add to this as well you have to think about the the heartache if you carry carry knives around with you Think about the heartache that the that the that the, the 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 victim's parents are going to have to endure. You might you, you know you know that's. I mean, for some teenagers and ad and young adults, they don't really think about what they're doing. It seems to me that they don't think about what they're doing. They don't think about the consequences after doing crime. They probably think it's easy pickings, you know it's no big deal but you know you have no idea what you're letting yourselves into when you when you when you do crime and and I'm and I'm being prompted I f you know I feel a surge uh, I feel a, a surge of prompting not a surge but I feel a prompting by the Holy Spirit to reveal to, to say this scripture again like I said in in one of my videos and the what and the title I've just given to you of this one which is called what would happen if I carry knives and guns around with me so I've said I said the scripture in that, that 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 video as well but I'll say it again in this one where it says in 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 the new international version NIV translation where it says in Matthew 26 verse 52 it says put your put your sword back in its place Jesus said to him for all who draw 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 the sword will die by by the sword so if you think if we if we think that we're gonna get away with crime you, you're you're only deceit you're only deceiving yourself you're only lying to yourself which is what I mean and you, you have to think about the consequences when you when you do crime if you think you're going to get away with it, you're not going to get away with it. Have a look at my video of 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 evil being of of evil being 50, of evil being 50% 50, 50 powerful and good and good being 100% powerful. And in that, you you will find that you you know e evil will always lose. And you and you might you might be thinking carrying a carrying a knife around me, around me. Is is good, but you're only deceiving yourself because when you carry a, when when you 
when you carry a, carry a knife around you ar around with you 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 only you only going to cuz you only you only going to go and harm somebody cause, because if you carry a knife around you you know cuz knife is always, knife is always is always made to cut into something you know whether it's vegetables or meat or or a person you you're going to you're going to use knife for cutting into you're going to you're going to use knife always to cut into something so if you think you know you're safe with a knife you're deceiving yourself as well you know that's what a knife is is always there for to cut into something and to use it against somebody use it against a human being you know you you will get a tougher sentence and the, and the government needs to needs to put in a tougher sentence like like for life and also and also as 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 Christians we need to pray about it pray against it I should say so so you again I've said I've said it before you have to think about the consequences before you start to think you know if I carry a knife around or a gun around I'll be I'll be safe you have to you have to think about that don't think that you know you're going to get away with crime because you won't it will, it will catch up to you eventually it's not a case of it's not a case of if it catches up with you it's a ca it's more of a case of when it will catch up with you because the police and, 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 and authority will always be hot on our heels so yeah So what watch watch the vi watch the videos I've suggested to you on this video and if you've got any problems in finding it let me know then please or call me which is in which in which is in all the descriptions of my videos so I will talk with you all soon so God bless take care bye for now peace with you